Kid Rock in studio, Anthony, our special guest today. I got I got to start by just telling you, you, you kicked ass with that MTV icon with Arrow Smith. Thank you. Your version of uh, you did Mama Kin and uh, Last Child. Yeah, right? that was unbelievable. Yeah. I had to show these kids there was an Arrow Smith before MTV. <laughs> and you did. I did have some other tunes besides Janie's Got a Gun. Hell yeah, <laughs> old school. Hell yeah. It's got to be weird uh, singing their songs in front of them, though, right? Aren't you thinking like... No, uh, that was probably the easiest show I've ever done. It was like, it was like high school band practice. Yeah. It's like, let's play some Aerosmith tunes. Yeah. But they're watching you. You're like, I hope I'm doing good. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Why not? <laughs> Screw it. Just having fun. Yeah. How's everything going with the uh, tour? Good? Yeah. Yeah. People saying you're kicking ass, I mean... Yeah, we're doing good. That's kind great. of shaking up the industry right now because the record company's not making any money, but we're making all the money to them. Good. good. And it's a great album, Cocky. Thank you. Why ain't the record company making money? Because Flip we're not down. selling tons of units. No one's selling tons of records now. The, the business is way down. The Everyone's pilfering off of the uh, Internet. Is that uh, well, part they, of it? They like, to blame it the, they like to blame it on the kids, you know, yeah. downloading the stuff for free on the Internet. What do you think? I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm rich. What do I care? <laughs> God damn, that's a good answer. So you're not been out of shape like Metallica and, and other bands when they say, hey, man, we're getting ripped off. No. <laughs> I can't. Okay, that's great. That's I, can't, I can't read him though. I don't know if he's telling the truth. No, I, mean, I honestly don't say you yeah, really don't understand. care. Yeah. I think that's. I think that's really cool, man. A lot of people all bent out of shape. You know, They're like oh, we would have sold more records if it wasn't for the internet. To see Metallica bitches, like relax, man. Yeah, those are my boys. I love Metallica. No, I know, but yeah. I mean, how much? I money? think it's more Lars. The other guys no, just I mean, like Lars. Kind of, the no, I think the thing is kind of the thing. They got a they got a great deal with their company. I think they own half their masters or something. So they kind of gotta. Yeah. Stand up for what they own. None of all of us, you know, little weasels at the bottom. We don't own Jack. <laughs> you know, we're just getting pennies from the record company, making money on the road. So, what really, you don't even own your own stuff, right? No, I mean, that's you own a piece goes. of it. But yeah. At the end of the day, you really don't. No. God, that's so I don't care. Did you get a Kid Rock album from like 1990? You know, like uh, you know the Polyfuse method. Yeah. Do you get any of that money, or is that just such a bad actually, deal back some, in the day? No, actually, I didn't make some coin off that because that record company was an independent out of New Jersey. Actually, and they went belly up, and they sent me like about I don't know, about 4,000 CDs when when I got off the label. So I took them and hocked them at record stores myself. <laughs> And I made and I made eight bucks a CD. <laughs> wow, probably more than you make off any other CD, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Doesn't compare to selling ten million, but at the time, yeah, it, was, you know. it worked out for you. I, I should tell everyone, Jay Moore's in the studio too. Jay right. Moore, oh, I defer to Kid Rock, gentlemen. No, yeah. I know, but I'm just you <laughs> know, you're talking, you're talking no one knows, you know, it's oh, you. Yeah. Well, sorry if you were confused in your car and you just put down your one hitter and you're not sure who's talking when. <laughs> but yeah, I'm here too. I just can't believe. Kid Rock, this is uh. So you know Jay, man. Yeah, you know Rock Jay from. Uh, I do now. Yeah, that's now we're now. We were in Nam together. You Where are you? <laughs> <laughs> that's right. <laughs> you remember, it. man. You remember. Yeah. I, I, you never forget a guy that's major for that. I didn't know Jay Moore. Jay's just met on the sport. radio. From, uh, Saturday Night Live. There you go. He's going way back. Way back. back. Old school. Back. Now he's on more sports. That's right. He doesn't shake his ass. Yeah, now so. Speaking of kicking ass, how about the Red Wings last night? What happened, Oh, man? boy. Now we got a problem. I look at, <laughs> there was upsets. Uh, also, didn't, New I'm, Jersey lost, too. I'm an Islander. Like two two I'm, weird upsets. I'm an yeah. Islander fan. Huh? Islanders. Islander fan over here. you got to give it to me. First time in the playoffs in eight years, so. Oh, well, I think, I'm, I'm not giving you not, nothing. I'm from Detroit. I understand <laughs> that. I know that. we got the all-star team. We can't be I, losing to Vancouver. You guys are going to be tough to beat this year. I hope so. Because, I want because you know, a couple of those are my buddies. I just want to get a hold of that cup and have a party. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that. Yeah, you don't even think in those terms. You'd be able to drink out of the cup. I drank, I drank out of the Islander Cup uh, way back when. when I was whose, cup, whose cup was it in the locker room? It's the only <laughs> cup they've had. In, no, in no. The when, they, <laughs> when the Islanders were winning in the early 80s, bro. Really? Yeah, Clark Gillies brought the, the cup to the Huntington Crescent Club. What were you, 10? That's what I'm saying. <laughs> I didn't get to drink the booze out of it, but it was Kool-Aid or something. That's good, right? I got a picture with the cup. <laughs> Is that all right? F yeah. Fondled by Bobby I mean, Nystrom? Yeah. It might be cooler to drink Kool-Aid out of the cup. <laughs> the cup is... <laughs> actually, if you think about it, that's pretty pimpy. When, when, you, from the when you check out the cup, uh, you know, close up, it is effed up, man. There's all sorts of dents and scratches. It looks all nice because they polish it up for uh, the TV, but it's a mess, that thing. Wait, looks like I, wait, I get a hold of that thing. <laughs> I can imagine. <laughs> <laughs> Put it on the hood of your car. <laughs> I'm going yeah. to bronze it and screw everything up. <laughs> <laughs> so we heard you flew into New York just to have lunch. Is that true? 
No. Oh, all right. Well, yeah. It sounded, yeah. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. yeah. It sounded really cool. Like yeah. it's something a rock star gets to do. Just fly to New York for lunch. When I have lunch, I go down to Burger King or something. <laughs> <laughs> Pull the bus over, man. Yeah. All right. He's not. Uh, not really the the full rock star we thing. You're not flying big, around. We did go to a pretty floofy restaurant, though. You did, you? Yeah. Where? Um, Cirque. Ah, I look at you. All the, all the, I don't know those All the big timers right. go there. And That's right. I don't go we don't, there. We don't make, make that list. Big time in New York City. We go to, uh, like, Fuji for sushi. <laughs> <laughs> we can't even swing the big name place. <laughs> we have nothing. I was such a tool last night. Tool. I went to see Took my girlfriend to go see uh, No Doubt down at uh, Roseland, you know? See, I was at the real show. I went and jammed with Government Mule. Yeah, they, you did. And everyone yeah. said you were unbelievable, by the way. Thank you. The feedback's coming in like crazy. Yeah. Those guys rock, man. Like, I'm, I'm still at the point. You know, we got a pretty popular radio show. Can you explain to Kid Rock so you think we're a bunch of fags and you don't, you're not really into No Doubt? I said, I took my girlfriend, but, you know, I'll sit and I'll listen to the band. We want someone like a Kid Rock to come back to our show. It's like, look, <laughs> he's coming back if he thinks you're a, like my, a No Doubt groupie. My chick likes the music, and Gwen's not hard to look at on right. stage, you know. She's kind of cute, so it's fine. And the fans are really hot. Well, don't look yeah. at me like that, Norton. They do get some smoking hot girls in that audience, though. The, the Gwen and Bees. That are about 15 years old. Great. <laughs> like, like I said, I was over at the government. Yeah. Right. So. <laughs> but I don't get any, you know, I, I, cloud egg. I try to work my way into like a g good section of reserved you were tables rock. You were and stuff. Rocking. We got no, video. I get nothing. Yeah, I get was. nothing. Play the um, Hey Baby dirt. song. <laughs> Come on, play it. Yeah. <laughs> it, it's, it is funny as hell when you look at the crowd right up front, and there's the, there's what was the crowd two like? got well, it's gay, girls. gay guys and a lot of young girls. So that's you know what are you gonna do when you see this big go to the government mule go show. <laughs> Are they all did. over 18, I hope? You see, that's, that's the thing. You no, go to no, no. show, you, no, want, like, you want to pork everything in the audience, and they're all 15 years old. Yeah, you might, might want to speak to R. Kelly about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah there you go. Go. R. Yeah, Kelly. Now we're on the board. Wait, yeah, now Thanks we can talk. Gentlemen. Did you see that tape? Rolling. I haven't seen the tape. Yeah. No? We've seen the tape. I'm in there. We saw the tape. I, I have talked to someone that heard it. It's, it's, or had, has seen yeah, it. Yeah, we've seen it. The yeah. first two girls, it's really hot. By the third girl, you're like, oh, God. You're like, what he's is he doing? pretty much giving her oral instructions. That's just, like, because she's just got it all wrong. That's just sick, man. It was pretty, pretty doing that. Pretty yeah, nasty. You should tape it, at least. <laughs> you can't. <laughs> <laughs> no. I just think that's a no-no. Morals from Kid Rock. I don't think he's going to do too well in prison either. He's, he's uh, no. he's going to be a real celebrity ass in there. <laughs> celebrity <laughs> ass. You know, if you're a guy looking at ass all day, he's not. He's probably easier on on, on the eyeballs than most of the other inmates. Oh, I'm saying R. Kelly would probably be like a line. <laughs> oh, God, that's <laughs> twisted. I don't even think about that. No, that's the ultimate. If you're going to have sex with people that are 15 years old, that's what should happen to them. Yeah. That's usually what does happen. Good. I'm saying that's one Child great point about oh, yeah, They don't yeah, fare well in prison. No. no. I know I killed 15 people, but you got a problem. <laughs> when you see uh quickly back to the no doubt thing when you see these like big brawny guys the old tattooed singing just looking up at the stage singing at the top of their lungs i'm just a girl <laughs> you're like what the yes you are what the hell is <laughs> yes, that about are. at that point you are this is i'm just a girl and they're singing loud as ever just having a good old, having a gay old time. Did you buy a Sam tour program, did you? <laughs> yeah, there you go. Bought a little program. No. T-shirt. But I couldn't get, yeah, I had the Gwen T-shirt. <laughs> I couldn't get anything. Like, I don't even rate. We have kind of a popular show here in New York. We're syndicated now all over the place. I go in there. I go to one of the security guys. I'm like, hey, slip me in this part over here, you know, <laughs> whatever. Shut down I'm even ready to throw him some cash or something. Nothing. I get squat on nothing. I am a zero. You gotta get your face on TV. You gotta do something. I don't know what the move is. You guys, you know, I know Jade being there. Forget about Kid Rock. He'd be, you know, the security guy be throwing their chicks at him. I'd be over at the government mule show. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. How was that government mule show? <laughs> that was good. Those guys Government jammed. mule. Yeah. And that's like, you know, Kid of the Almond Brothers, so. Yeah. Know. They're I unbelievable. Can... Who was jamming? The guy from the Crows there jamming and Jason Newstead from Metallica. It was a good jam. Wow. wow. Yeah. What a party that the is. Are broken up now? Yeah. Is that official? Yeah. It's not just a rumor? What yeah. do you listen to like yep. in your tour bus when you're driving from city to city? Like, you're just going to turn something on and crank it. Um, what does Kid Rock just say? All right, I put grab, this in. I grab all the, uh, all the 
CDs out of the truck stops, you know, all those stuff. He's a Bob Seger Hank guy. Williams Jr. <laughs> George Jones is good drinking music. Yeah? Yeah. I like to crank that. We, you know, I've been, we've been cranking People are up are crashing their cars right now trying to figure out who George Jones is. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus <laughs> Jones? Did you just say Jesus Jones? <laughs> right, yeah. right now. And we, all, and we all nodded to Kid Rock like, yeah, we know, man. George Jones. We're cool yeah. like you. We know George Jones. I've been listening to a lot of his band. Yeah? Oh, really? Yeah. See, now I know that. <laughs> Any hip-hop on the Kid Rock bus? Any right, hip-hop. Uh, no, just Uncle Cracker's doing a remake of The Freaks Come Out at Night with uh, Buster Rhymes, so he's been playing the hell out of that. He's working on his wow. new album, so we're hearing that all the time. But uh, Now, what are you hearing about the Black Crows? What happened? You can give some inside scoop here. You're inside. What, well, you want to hear what I think happened? You're in the loop. Which probably didn't happen. I think the Kid Rock opinion is think the brothers just the finally dude, had it with each no, other? No, that dude married the Hollywood chick and he's in Hollywood. Uh-oh. Can't have a southern rock band in Hollywood. Oh. That's my person. I mean, Eddie's my boy. Eddie's from Detroit, the keyboard player. Yeah. One of my good, good friends. And I still don't know the story because I haven't talked to him about it. I'm just making it up. He's <laughs> got to be bummed. He's out of a gig, kind of. Yeah, no, nah, he'll be back with somebody in a hurry. Those guys are such good players. They'll get a gig. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go to the phones. Everyone's freaking out that Kid Rock's here today. Hello. Wayne, what's going on, man? Hey, Bob. How you doing? Hey. Great, man. H have uh, you ever thought about putting a cover uh, album together to pay respect to all the people you love? Yeah, actually, I have. We just, matter of fact, they came up with the uh, Aerosmith, the icon thing we did with those songs. Someone said you should do that. So I'd love to do that. It's like probably one of the easiest records to make. I yeah, but you make record. those songs your own, though. I mean, yeah, a lot of people can't pull it off like you you do. I mean, last night on the MTV Icon, unbelievable version of Mama Came the Last Job. Thank you. Steven Tyler, I mean, you, you did his voice wonderful. Yeah. yeah. Nice. All right, hey, Bob, I'll see you in Cleveland. All right, Wayne. Yeah, it's time. Well, man, I've had those guys, you know, when they. You know what's funny, those guys, because they're sober and everything, you know? Yeah. Straight so every time you're walking with a drink, you know, Tyler's like, let me smell that. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> yeah, Tyler's like, man, I used to love to get high. I used to, I used to get up out of my rehab bed and spin in circles. <laughs> you know, but, you know, I've had him out to that. I got a little suit. <laughs> Timmy! <laughs> I'm getting up. Uh, we've had him out to the studio when they come through town. Last time they came through town, Detroit, I went and jammed with them. They came over to the studio after, and we were back in the woods, and we jammed until about 6 in the morning. Wow. Those guys still love to play, which is nice to get somebody, you know, that's been around that long. Usually people are like, you know, let's yeah. do this, let's do that or something. They just want to come over, pick up instruments, you know, roadies on the drums, whatever, just jammed all nice. night. Jamming with Aerosmith. Just jamming with Aerosmith. Yeah. Then we're going to wing on over to London, <laughs> jam with the Stones. <laughs> <laughs> Where'd you get this jacket? <laughs> oh, the network gave it to me. <laughs> hey, we could do the whole... I know, oh, know I know that Isn't that great, man? Great. We sit here for hours on end. Just you and my friend are a wuss. Part <laughs> whip, part pussy. <laughs> hey, Rent, would not you get that out of the hamper? <laughs> <laughs> we had a version of that movie. It was just Spicoli's lines. That's great. That's, that's top, it was that's like top a, three. It was like a 20-minute tape. Yeah. Just Spicoli. That's it. Came over here to help you out with your homework on such a hot day. <laughs> I found your wallet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thanks. Uh, great, yeah. Hey, Debbie. <laughs> Kiss me. You won't regret it. <laughs> Learning about That's Cuba. That's the attitude. Having... <laughs> the attitude. Sure, you put out the vibe to 8,000 chicks. Up. That's the attitude. That's the attitude. <laughs> That's the idea. <laughs> the moan. The moan. The moan rocks. You wanted it as much as I did. <laughs> no, take that back. <laughs> All right, I'm sorry. Oh my All right, God. earth, wind, and fire, and hey, I could brother. really use that $20, yo. <laughs> He's taking the phone call to get the abortion for his chick. <laughs> earth, wind, and fire, and little brother. And little brother. <laughs> okay. No one sampled that guy. <laughs> Don't. With it. <laughs> nice car, you're really keeping it up wonderfully. <laughs> I tell you, I know that. That, Hell yeah, that man. Forrest Gump, I know every line. <laughs> Forrest Gump. That's a great movie, man. Classic. That is. We had an exchange student when I was a kid, probably about eighth grade. They came over from like the Netherlands or something, this girl. And she's like, what is high school going to be like? And I popped that in. I oh, like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's an accurate depiction. <laughs> Guys rolling out of vans, hitting themselves in the head with sneakers. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I'm so wasted. Guys pulling their cranks in the bathroom outside yeah. the pool. They don't make movies. No like dice. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't anyone have been knock anymore? You had shirts on when you came in here. <laughs> no, we didn't, Mom. 
<laughs> Something must have happened to him. <laughs> uh, hey, why don't we uh, jam something from uh, Cocky? Yeah. Yes. Cool. And then we'll take a little break, and we, you're, you're going to be around for a little bit, right? Sure, man. What do you want to hear? We're in 18 cities. We'll play whatever the hell you want. Well, uh, you, you never met a mf -er like me? Do you got the clean one? I think. Uh oh we, this Oh, one, we do? This yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we'll play that. I think this one's called You Never Met a White Boy Quite Like Me because you can't say M or F -er on. Yeah, on the radio. They got a problem with the M or F -er. Yeah, the M or F -er. <laughs> The mother part. This is okay. actually, we're going to do a video for this next. <laughs> cool. Isn't that well, weird that you would say M or F -er and not Mother F -er? I don't know yet. M or F -er. M or F -er. We all say <laughs> Mother F. -er. Direct it yourself. <laughs> Direct it yourself. I have trouble holding I, the camcorder still. My son's walking like, <laughs> plays at school. <laughs> I'll direct your film. All right, let's check out. <laughs> and we're back with the Opie and Anthony show. Kid Rock in studio, having a lot of fun. Uh, 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 we're we're telling yeah. uh, Kid Rock about uh, Jim Norton here. Yeah, Jimmy, uh, you've enlightened us a bit. Is it true now that girls kind of don't want you to wear a bag anymore? Yeah. Now that you're so... So popular on the program I'm, I'm, and I'm doing, selling out shows all over the country. Years I'm doing comedy. It's always no, and occasionally you get a drunk one, but you got to wear two rubbers. And you know, now you know you're doing good, and all of a sudden, like, no, you don't have to wear a rubber. <laughs> <laughs> Did you they want the Norton seed. Leave it in. Leave Did your, you always leave your American Express on the table. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, no, I don't. I pulled. I just like to hear it. It's just like, <laughs> you mean I could have? <laughs> Do you always wear condoms? I never. I don't believe in them. I'm immune. No. <laughs> I'm immune. No. Remind me not to walk in your circle. <laughs> I always like back in the day would assume, you know, wherever she was from meant whether or not she could have AIDS. I'd be like, really? oh, you know what? She's from Minnesota. How could she possibly have AIDS? Yeah, Is that it? Her father's a dentist. What could she have? <laughs> Jesus, man. Her father's practically a doctor. You know she's clean. She's from Minnesota. Her father, you know, come on. What you do is you ask her a question in Creole, and if she understands it, <laughs> you put a condom on. <laughs> right. You're wrong, man. we got to remind everyone, Kid Rock's playing uh, Madison Square Garden, uh, May 10th. Oh, oh that, little, 10th. that little room. Yeah. That little That's dog. nice. God damn. The rock in the garden. Who's on the show with you? Uh, I think Lit. Lit is. How much time do they do? They'll wow. do it 20 minutes. 20 minutes. <laughs> when they call me, I go onto the stage. <laughs> no, no, we're going to try to have some guests out for that. Yeah. Yeah, I guess maybe we have a little Hank come up in Tennessee and rock New York City and maybe Cheryl Crow come out. And... You like Jimmy Vaughn? Sure. Sure. We just signed him for more sports. No, I don't know. It's out of the blue. We just signed him for more sports. <laughs> I want to see if he had street cred with the Kid Rock. Yeah. Street cred. <laughs> you know, we like on the show when we have musical acts, you know, like when you come out of the gates with like Rock Him and have, you know, yeah. you want to have like more of a boutique mentality. You had Rock Him on? That was our first guy, just to make a little I statement. No to, you know, he used to let the mic Right. Smoke. Let Rock Him take over. Well, show. at the end of more sports, yeah. There's yeah. always a band playing. So we just, I thought of Jimmy Vaughn and I thought, you I know. just got that, more sports. That's <laughs> Don't let the day sneak up on you, Bobby. <laughs> Hippie lettuce, baby, for the glaucoma. It's this fancy beer they got up here. Yeah, yeah, the Where's, Sam Adams. Come on, man. Help me out for my glaucoma. Where's the cores, man? <laughs> what are you guys doing? Uh, that's what we drink here on the, uh, we, on the yeah, East Coast. Yeah, it's a know. big time. We, on the East Coast. We got a bunch of flavors. Yeah, that's true. If he wants a cores, get him a cores. Yeah! You really want Coors? We'll have it up here in two months. I love Coors. They gave me a ton of money to sponsor my tour. And people... <laughs> oh, there we go. That's right. Hey, get people, your Coors flowing. People call it selling out. They can suck it because in the reality, it keeps ticket prices down. So, so people ain't got to pay 50 bucks to see a show. It's 30 bucks to come see a two-hour show. Hey, kid, guess who gave us a load of money? Sam Adams. <laughs> 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 see how that works? Well, see how that works? They went in Greece up there, you know. They're pretty much keeping us on the air. Right. No one else will advertise with our oh, show. we love the Sam Adams. <laughs> right. That's funny, man. Chris from D.C., what's going on? Hey, what's going on, man? How are you? We're hanging with Kid Rock. Pimp of the Nation. What's going on, Kid Rock? Hey, early morning stone pimp. Outstanding. Hey, I'm from Saginaw, Michigan originally. Been listening to you since about 89. Nice. Yeah, I just wanted to say hello, man. It's, uh, it's awesome that you're on the O&A show. Thanks, man. Remember, Lefty yeah. Frizzell wrote that song, I was born in Saginaw, Michigan. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Lefty Frizzell, the coach at Georgia State? No, Lefty Frizzell. Oh, Frizzell. Oh, Frizzell. <laughs> you know one of my favorite Frizzell. songs? What? Balls in Your Mouth. Yeah, you remember that? It's an old one. It's an old one, bro, but it's awesome, man. It's awesome. I like it. 
Thank I've been uh, in the Marine Corps for about seven years, and I play it all over the place. God bless so, you. Just wanted to say what's up, man. What's up, brother? You got you hang in there, man. We'll probably see if you look for me in my red caddy this summer. All right, bro. Take right. care. All right, Chris. You still get home alive? What's that? You still get home? Uh, we only play. Alive? We only play three days a week. We do what? That's we, it? we do like Nashville touring. They call it. like the country guys. Do we play Thursday, Friday, Saturday? <laughs> then beat your wife and then fly home. <laughs> that's, that's, that's the, the shooting, country way. It's also the shooting schedule right. for hee haw. <laughs> We get you go we, home. We get skunks. home. I smell skunks. Here's a country song. He said, "We get home to Nashville on a Monday night. Record songs on Tuesday and on Wednesday. Pay the ex-wife. <laughs> <laughs> then on Thursday night, it's back on the road. I don't care if it's Montana down in Louisiana, just as long as I go. That's my life, and I love it." Three on, huh? You guys, aren't, you you guys never yeah. heard that one. No, <laughs> no, no. just did, baby. Nah. Put it down for everybody. Not, and, hey, I know some old school stuff like that, but I just never heard that one. I like, well, I pulled out of Pittsburgh and rolling, rolling down, down the Eastern Seaboard. I got my diesel wound up and she's, she's running, running like I've never before. There's a speed on the hill, right? hill all right. I don't I see a cop in sight. Six days on the road and I'm going to make it home tonight. <laughs> Someday the mountain lions will catch him, but the law never will. <laughs> Just a good old boy. <laughs> never meaning, no never meaning no harm. <laughs> Beats all you ever saw. Been in trouble with the law since the day they was born. Straightening them curvers, flattening them hills. Someday the mountain might get them, but the law never will. Making their way the only way they know how. That's just a little bit more than the law will allow. <laughs> I do that every night. Do you? Oh, yeah. I, play that, in the middle of, I play that in the middle of Cowboy as a tribute to our old God friend Waylon. damn. Black Waylon. people just ran out of this building. <laughs> 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 you gotta know a few old black this girl, great too, because we'll 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 just, we'll just bust into it in the middle of Cowboy. And, it, you know, by the time we finish doing the verse, people still haven't put it. Like, They're like, where do I, I know, know that from, right? I grew up yeah. on that. What is that? How do I know this country song? Friday nights at 9 o'clock. That's right. right. <laughs> we were trying to figure out the words of the fall guy the other day. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I've been seen oh. with Farrah. <laughs> oh, yeah. A little hay. Hey, hey, I might fall from a tall building, I might roll a brand new car. I'm the unknown stuntman that makes Eastwood such a star. So, yeah. Come yeah. on, who didn't watch The Fall Guy? Oh, yeah. If you didn't watch The Fall Guy, you're suspect. You were a faggot. <laughs> hey, dude, Fall Guy's on. Don't be a faggot. <laughs> hey, Tim, what's going on? Tim, on, too. Faggot. <laughs> no. Let's go back to the phone. Hey, what's Tim. Up, Tim? Hey, Tim. Tim, we lose you? Speck and Z. Radio Ragoon. Hello. Uh, we'll try somebody else here. Let's go to Roger. Hey, uh, Roger, what's Roger, up? Roger, hello. Hey, how you doing? We're hanging with hey, Rock. What's up, hey, Rock, how you doing? Hey, what's up, Roger? Hey, I'm doing great. Um, you, got, you performed Mitt last night. Yeah. Absolutely Mitt. Thank you. And uh, I can't believe O and A. I'm kind of disappointed, but I like to say congratulations to you. Oh, thank you. On the uh, the big when's the big day? Oh, we're putting it together. You're putting it together. Well, congratulations. Is she in the uh, in the studio with you? Come on, man. We got Kid <laughs> yeah, Rock in yeah. the studio. She's she's around. She's, she's around. Dis she's distracting everyone's foosball games. That's well, I'm doing. doing your job over there. You should be asking these things. <laughs> we're, we're getting there, bro. <laughs> talking with, hey, with Kid Rock, Rock about his Kid Rock. Yeah. yeah. They got to work me into it, man. <laughs> All right. See. Well, what are, you gonna, what are you going to break up the fall guy? Yeah, right? <laughs> talking about, talking about a wedding? Who cares about a wedding if you're going to sing the fall guy? We're singing Dukes of Hazzard. Right, yeah, I know. Uh, sorry, I didn't mean anything. Old, <laughs> country, yeah, old country really song. <laughs> Once was a man, he couldn't cry. You know that one? No. no. Johnny Cash. It's on his uh, the Rick Rubin one. one I don't know that one. Oh, uh, no, okay. couldn't cry. All right, we got to go to Johnny. You got to get right down to it. The old school. The old school. <laughs> I fell into a burning ring of fire. I went down, down, down. The flames went higher. And it burns, burns, burns. The ring of fire. The ring of fire. <laughs> I remember that one. For that, you throw on Freddie Fender. <laughs> I have to be a. I like Johnny Cash. That's not yeah, my love Johnny Cash. How could you well, not like? If you don't like Johnny Cash, you could be suspect. I agree. I think, what is it? American Recordings, the one Rick Rubin produced, is yeah. the one he, that uh, has. The, there was a man who couldn't cry. 
live at like a coffee house. It's really weird. It's like the saddest song in the world, and they're like laughing. Well, it's like Altamont of country music. <laughs> Altamont. <laughs> it's so bizarre. He's like talking about like he, he, his dog got run over, his, he got cancer, and they're all what? like, yeah. <laughs> you know the old country joke, what you get if you play a country record backwards, right? No. You get your car, your wife, and your dog back. Ah, that's right. Ding. Ladies and gentlemen, Kid Rock and more sports Monday night. Don't miss it. <laughs> yeah, why don't you come on the show, man? Don't Excuse punt. Bucket, man. Out there. We booked Rock Kim so you know where we're coming from. That's right. right. What was that cool. band you had? The, the guys, uh, Third Strike to play Paranoid. I didn't want to hear the hit. Paranoid. Yeah, I didn't hear the hit on the radio. Right. I said, you want to come on and play Paranoid. Who's that song? band does the, the theme song to... Uh, Remy uh, Zero? They played the... the, the they, they did a good job. They did the song. Yeah, the guy's got some voice. He's got pipes, man. He's like, to do that live, it sounded really good. Pete Rose's gum got taken off the internet. <laughs> what, what, it was what? really on the internet. His what guy? Uh, we interviewed Pete Rose because Luis Gonzalez's gum was on the internet. Someone was selling spit out gum. We had uh, Pete Rose chew Big, uh, Big Red. Yeah. And he put like five watts <laughs> in his mouth and we put it in a beaker. He signed it and we put it on eBay. <laughs> Pete Rose is the man. He is the man. Oh, yeah. First thing he ever said to Barry Katz, my manager goes, Hi, Pete, I'm Barry. And he goes, Tony Perez took the biggest dump in the history of Three River Stadium. <laughs> I mean, we didn't even flush it. It was unbelievable. <laughs> Concepcion, he's a little light, you know. He comes in. I'm sorry, fellas. I don't have any linea. You know what I mean? Ted, how do you talk? <laughs> he was out of control because he was just so happy we weren't, we weren't asking him about gambling. Like I, I was, right. I, I wanted to talk to Pete Rose about hitting. Right. Everyone talks. And to he him just about had the gambling. best time. He was retarded. I was surprised to see that the uh, Pete Rose hair is gone. He looks like Peppermint that, Patty. That trademark <laughs> hair. His, his hair is racing. His hair, his hair is racing to the back of his neck. Yeah. yeah. yeah that and trademark. he's losing. That big uh, trademark head of I got, like Mo Howard hair. One here, you know the mullet thing's so huge now. But I, I heard the best term from one of my roadies. We were in Kentucky, <laughs> and there was this roadie who had just the ultra mullet. So you know, kind of having a good laugh off it during <laughs> the show or whatever. He's like, so after the show, he's like, you see that guy in the front with that mullet? My, my drum tech, my 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 girl's drum tech goes, that's not a mullet. That's a Kentucky neck warmer. <laughs> 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 I like the ball guys that got the mullet. They call it a skullet. <laughs> what? A skullet. A skullet. He's if got like the hair. A skullet, the you might be a redneck. <laughs> call it a skullet. Business up top, party in the back. <laughs> <laughs> The 1090. <laughs> <laughs> or the schlong. Short in the front, long in the back. <laughs> the schlong. Hey, we got to go to the phones. Jeannie's freaking out. Jeannie, what's up? Hey. We're talking oh, to Kid Rock. Oh, yeah, just hey. I'm touching myself just hearing you, Kid Rock. Big, uh, big. Hey, why don't we play What's in My Pants with Kid Rock? Mm. Uh, we would love to, I but love there are it. certain uh, pending litigations about what? that. Bit. I made, I created it. I know sense. you created a monster, Who you bastard. Who do I have to talk to? I'll make this happen. We're gonna come find your uh, your your checkbook. Yeah. Go to, <laughs> go to Washington D.C. Find check. the Federal Communications Commission building and find someone to speak to there. That's right. They'll send you, you some reason they had a problem with. You can with, reach uh, me at jmorelive.com. <laughs> Look at you. I bro. answer all, yeah, all my own email. Hey, Jeannie. So what's up? All right, I'm telling you, I'm touching myself just here. <laughs> How old are you? I love this one. I love him. Sounds like Patty. I touch myself with one hand and I uh, oh, smoke okay. my luckies with the other. And you know something? I would do that horn trumpet, whatever, with him any day. The rusty trombone? You ever hear that? Uh, oh, boy. Yesterday, the rusty that trombone. It's when a girl licks, All right, Jimmy, she licks the dirty penny or your balloon knot or whatever you want to call it I. as she reaches around the front and works you like a trombone. <laughs> I'm sheltered. It's called the rusty trombone, and uh, it really there's a special gal that'll do that uh, for you. I'm her name is Sylvia Gauze. All right, uh, Jeannie, that's all you got. Um, I miss little Joe. Yeah, yeah who doesn't? I know. Bob, you ever think about doing um country just a country, just yeah. an ultimate fu to the record company, just yeah. release something just for the next? Yeah. Uh, Kid Rock playing the Garden, uh, May 10th. Take us through Ticketmaster. Hell yeah. Kid Rock Cocky on the Opie and Anthony Show. That's the name of the latest CD from Kid Rock Anthony. Let me tell you guys yeah. something about Kid Rock. <laughs> yes, Chris okay? Penn. I used to drink with this guy back in the day. That's how long we've been running around together. <laughs> All right? Daddy, why don't you have a little Remy Martin so me and Kid Rock can sit back and play some rock and roll here? <laughs> you hear that, Daddy? He's got so much black semen pumped up. He's starting to talk like one of them. You're always so angry, Chris. <laughs> You're going to tell me Kid Rock's going to decide out of the blue to rip us off. Bye. 
Bobby, why do you tell me what really happened? <laughs> Jay Moore in the studio as well. Yes. More sports Mondays at 1230. <laughs> I just blew a nut. Listen, really fast, i got to tell everyone, because we're in a lot of cities. Kid Rock playing uh, May 9th, first Union Spectrum in, uh, in Philly there, Anthony. The FUC Center. The FU Center, That's yes. right. Uh, then at, uh, May 10th, it's at the Garden in New York. Uh, Cleveland at the Amphitheater on uh, May 17th. Rock and roll! And Chicago on May 18th. All over the ball field. And yeah. we're in all those cities there, Mr. Rock. Somebody yeah. explain to me why if I grew up in California, I'm walking around with a Chicago accent. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'd like you to decide for me right now, Larry. Stop pointing that gun at my daddy. <laughs> That's pretty good. That's a good one, man. I only roll out the good ones. <laughs> Very good, I'm Jack. like you. I don't F around. <laughs> Aerosmith, no problem. Yeah, Kid huh. Rock's at Madison Square Garden, May 10th. May 10th. Yes. He'll be, be on more sports in July. We're gonna make, we're gonna, <laughs> he can gonna make that happen, Jay. Come out and play Waylon Jennings on the show, whatever you want. That would be cool. Uh, real fast, Eddie, what's up? Hey, guys. How you doing? Hey, Dad. What's up, Eddie, from the Carousel East? Oh, hold on, Eddie. <laughs> oh, yeah. Play that on more sports, and we have motocross footage behind you. <laughs> motocross? Wow, this or Dukes of Hazard footage. I guess it is the Steve Lynch guitar. Steve, <laughs> no, Steve C came story. up with it. Well, what people think about me and what I think about them. People say I'm no good. I'm crazy as a loon. I get stoned in the morning. I get drunk in the afternoon. Kind of like my old blue tip hound I like to lay around in the shade I ain't got much money I damn sure got it made I ain't asking nobody for nothing If I can't get it on my own If you don't like the way I'm living you just leave this long hair country boy alone. <laughs> how, 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 how? It just doesn't sound the same out of a Fender twin. <laughs> hey, are you doing any gigs in uh, Rochester? Uh, stop, Jim. Man, Man, you are the stop. absolute worst. I was Norton. trying to see if you were doing a gig up there. No, you're trying to plug one of your shows. Stop. Shameless. It's not about you today. You're making Jay look like he never plugs. <laughs> shoot you right down. Yeah, John Lee, baby. Right off your feet now. Take you home with me. <laughs> Last night, I heard Mama talking to Daddy. She said that boy wants to boogie woogie, and that boy wants to boogie woogie. He got him in it, and it's got to come out. Oh, I feel so good now. <laughs> Mama said I boogie woogie all night long. Oh, I feel so good, y'all. Mama said I boogie woogie all night long. I had no idea if that's what I said. <laughs> oh, you got to finish. Hey, that was working. That was that working. Phenomenal. <laughs> hey, we got to say hi to Adam Farrar really fast. He's on his way to, uh, to the to the Tonight Show, Anthony. Sweet home Alabama, though, Adam. <laughs> Adam, hold on a minute. <laughs> tonight Show, come on. <laughs> Adam Farrar will be playing Sweet Home Alabama on the Tonight Show tonight.
<laughs> guitar players listening go, you suck. <laughs> Adam's well, checking good, in. Adam, Adam. Cause I made hey, it work guys. for me. Hey there, pal. What's going on, champ? We got We're that. hanging out with Kid Rock. That's Kid Rock? Sure. He's great. How are you, Kid Rock? Uh, I heard it said once before, better than you. <laughs> Adam is on uh, the Tonight Show tonight. Yeah, with Leno. Yeah. He's my go. pal from oh, like the, years ago. You're the sex guy. We beat bowling. <laughs> no, he's no. Adam Ferrara yeah. from uh, The Job. Oh. You ever seen the show The Job with Dennis Leary? Yeah. The newest one? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Olive Garden commercials. Yeah, you might. Wait, yeah, the Olive Garden commercials. He said Hospitaliano. Now that's a spicy meatball. <laughs> he's the first guy to say Hospitaliano. Uh, Adam, don't take any offense. His, come on, please. Please. You know who his girlfriend is? Yeah, that's I know. He that's, wins. That's, that's, why he, over. that's why he's not watching television, okay? Absolutely. So he doesn't know who Adam Ferrara is, okay? That's all right. Don't worry about it. What are you doing? You're on The Tonight Show. Tonight, yeah. I wanted to come see you guys yesterday, but uh, I had to come out here for this. And yeah, the rest of the guys on from the show? Yeah, yeah. They it was had fun. fun. Yeah, we missed you. Yeah. What how, you doing, that, how, did you, how did you get this? Um, They said, you want to come out and do it? And I said, yeah. That was pretty this. much it. Just like that? So what do you got planned? Um, I don't know, four fun-filled minutes. And then you're going over to sit and talk to and Jay. And you sit on the couch, you cross your legs, you hope your pants don't ride up. And uh, Leo, uh, not Leo, Enrique Iglesias comes out after me. Oh, really? Yeah. Both Enrique. All right, listen, Adam, we got to go. They got okay. no one. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Hey, Adam the... Farrar on the Tonight Show tonight. They got no one that's going to bump you. No, I don't know. Ah. Oh. Nah, I should, we should be all right. You get bumped, I'm getting pissed. <laughs> well, all right. I, I was wondering, uh, is anyone going to be up in Rochester tonight? Because I heard Norton's go around. <laughs> no, you know, off. Adam, I'm not plugging that. Who cares if tickets for my show go on sale tomorrow morning at Ticketmaster? It's not important. <laughs> you that's not what I like. And if you can't make that, whore. Saturday night in Bananas, I'll be there. So, All right, Adam. Look for right. right. tonight on uh, Jay Leno. On the all right, show. guys. Take Later. care, guys. Right, Take cool. it easy. Right. Later. Later. I'll play my song. Yeah. I'm seeing what's going on in the world. A lot of people bitching and complaining. They say rather than bitch and complain, why not be part of the solution? Solution, I got your solution. What if Kid Rock was the president of the United States? <laughs> If I was president of the good old USA, not turn our churches into strip clubs, and I'd watch the whole world parade. I give the working man back his money. I make them stank ass politicians a pay. If I was president, I swear I'd get the job done. You know, I'd uphold the freedom of speech, baby, and our rights to carry guns. I give my State of the Union address. From a mile high, smoking a joint on Air Force One. <laughs> you know what I said? Yeah, one more line again. Break it. Down. If I was president, I wouldn't lie and sneak around. You know what I mean, right? Yeah, yeah. Said if I was president, I wouldn't have sex in the Oval Office and then lie about it all across town. What would you do instead? You know what I do? I'd put TV cameras in the Lincoln bedroom So the whole nation could come watch old Rock laying it down Speak, speak, speak Woo! Yeah! yeah. Kid Rock! Count me in! Now people are calling up with uh, requests Jennifer, what's up? Uh, hey, I just wanted to say Kid Rock has a beautiful voice And uh, I actually you should hear me. To... You should hear me when I'm not drinking <laughs> hey, I was just actually wondering if you'd play a song for me. Sure, what do you want? Okay, listen, I don't like Bon Jovi, but I want you to play Dead or Alive. <laughs> Cover tunes <laughs> from Bon Jovi. Nope. Yeah. <laughs> I said no. How about the Fraggle Rock oh, theme song? On, That's man. awful. You know fun. Bon <laughs> I just want to do Richie Sambora's song. Bon yeah. Just singing Richie.
Richie's part. Dead or alive, and I'm a cowboy <laughs> on a steel horse I ride, and I'm wanted, wanted. <laughs> We're going to do Richie's. Richie's got the baddest part. Yeah. <laughs> the Richie part is the coolest part of that song. It's like Kenicki. It like, I'm a cowboy on a steel horse I ride, and I want it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's like in Greece, John Travolta gets to sing the entire song, but Kenicki gets to go, Grease Lightning. <laughs> That's all I wanted to do. Is be the guy to come out and go, Grease Lightning. The whole uh, show of uh, Grease is going to be on more sports. You're going to all get together? <laughs> no? Grease 2. We're going to get Michelle Pfeiffer and the gay guy. Nice and Skinner, man. Goddamn Skinner. How about Blue Sky? What an old free bird. How about Blue Sky? can't sing that without crying. Yeah, gets you all choked up. Too close to home. I just wanted to drink a beer. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Eddie wants it's in real fast. The uh, Kid Rock Tour is brought to you by Coors Light. There you go. Eddie! <laughs> Coors. Heard hey, on guys. The, Reg- regular Coors. Coors. Go ahead, Eddie. Wow. All, all the Coors. Hey, High guys. Coors. Eddie from Carousel East. Okay. Your favorite top club on Long Island. Nice. Hey, good yeah. place? Yeah. I, 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 wanted ask, uh, I wanted to ask Kid, because last night I blew up. The most popular song that the girls request No, he was rocking bass earlier with the six strings. Oh, you know, this is a really good request. I would love to hear this. We'll see if he goes with it. Scott, what's up? Hey, how you guys doing? All right. Love the show. Rock? Yeah. Love you, man. Thank you. Um, Mr. Rock. Cr- Cross Town Traffic by uh, Jimi Hendrix. Or any Hendrix. Any Hendrix? Anything you want to play. Anything. I got a cigarette and a core is going right now. You got to bear with me. <laughs> May 10th, Madison Square Garden. Absolutely. That's right. We came right. Mm-hmm. We, we're going to have a ton of tickets to give away. There a lot of shows. I got to go. Yeah, that's what they're saying. Yeah. What a, what a bummer. I heard what Pam said out there. She goes, she needs. You got to be somewhere by seven, and she needs time for um, sex, shower, and get dressed. <laughs> that's what she said. Like I said, I got to go. <laughs> Can she at least say hi just so we look cool? 
Just one high. I I won't sit. I won't ask her one. I won't ask her. I one. already got, uh, dude. I already got the picture. I was so bad. I I actually asked my girlfriend to take a picture of me. Yeah. How bad is that? And you were screaming at her. Hurry up and get the picture. Slide. Take it. Make sure the flash is on. <laughs> it's been real and it's been fun. Hey, yeah. Thank you, Kid Rock. We appreciate that Thanks, a lot. Nice to meet you. A lot of fun. Okay, good luck with your show. Thanks. No. Th thanks for making it a party, man. No problem. You want, you want to say hi, Pam, please? We'll look cool to our just friends. Just say hi, because our fans will like, look at us like we're cool, which we're just totally alive. not. We won't say anything else. Hi, Pam. I want to thank you guys for the time, because you know, the whole hour is going to be... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, God, we cut off. I'm sorry, man. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> you guys pump that show. You know how valuable. Well, pump, Hell yeah, we'll man. Pump like crazy. Thanks for coming down. I was going to say something else. Yeah. Let me get a pump and we'll, get out of here. We'll pump and yeah, you, you guys go. Why are you still standing here? <laughs> Arrest that woman. Congratulations, by the way, to you guys. Put a, yeah. put a 10 on that circus. All right. Yeah. Cool, man. Thanks. Nice Take it easy. Good to Peace. You, Pam. Kid Pam and I were on. Yeah. Me Pam and Kelly Anthony. together. I know. How it, cool is that? It's Pam. I was on Regis and Kelly with Pam. I actually got her good to see you again on a Pam. I heard that. You know yeah, something? We're outside. And uh, Pam goes up to Jay and goes, oh, good to see you again. I'm like, again? That's right, baby. <laughs> and I know Jay. Like I said before, he puts all these women in the in case of a <laughs> marital emergency break glass. Like he sets them up right to the point where he's ready to close the deal. Then he leaves them in limbo. So if anything happens, God forbid, with his marriage, he could just push, break glass and pull someone out. And I'm thinking... Has he been trying to put Pam in one of these things? Well, you got you got to stay in shape, guys. You're amazing. You know, you're you got to stay in shape more. Hey, Jay, you know, you've been here since the beginning, since uh, we started in New York. What a party! Remember, hey, remember the days? Oh, they today. Remember the days we were excited when Jay Moore came by? <laughs> uh, remember that? <laughs> no, it's like, hey, now, man. We, now we hang with Pam. The truth is, <laughs> the truth is the truth. Kid Rock. Kid Rock jamming and Pam just hey, hanging man, out. It is what it is. That's Kid Rock, man. That was straight early morning pimping. I think oh, he said it. Who are we kidding? We never get guests like that. Oh, I know. You know. You I, know why? Because your little meaty-breasted friend runs out. Take a quick picture with you. Oh. Boy, did they hate my guts for that. <laughs> did he get your pick? Of course I did. Between the two of them. The hottest couple and then sexual cancer in between them. <laughs> the hottest couple in Hollywood and I'm standing between them. God, do I not deserve this. I did see, nothing I... but drink and drug and cut. Thank you, guys. <laughs> see, right. I, see, I never asked for the pick. No. Because you're also a star. See, That's it's the difference. Cool. You're recognized yeah. everywhere. I look him in the eye cool. I said, much respect, man. See, you're cool. Wait, no, he's just too, you're too worried about being embarrassed. Get a picture. No. no I'm garbage. No, no, no. When you're in a situation where you believe that it's going to end tomorrow, I at least want photographic documentation yeah. of my career. You know, plus it's, if it was like a baseball player, I'd want, if it was like, you know, yeah. Hank Aaron, I'd want a picture. Ooh, I can was hot. He's <laughs> yeah, so sure. hot. Oh, no, no. I, well, Pamela, you know, I got lots of photos. No. Oh. <laughs> what am I, I saying? I had to with them. I had to do it. I know you did. I had to. I so did. Well, you know what? No matter how you take the picture out there, you're going to look like the guy at the radio station in between those two. Uh, exactly. That's oh, what I am. God. That's, what, no, no, that's no. why I didn't want the both of them. I wanted me and Pam. Um, you know where I'm putting that picture? I'm putting it up Screen on my... Screensaver. No, you know, they got this thing called classmates.com. <laughs> and and uh, I went to John Glenn High School out on Long Island, and the people post their pictures. Here's me and my husband of five years. Here's me and my husband of 20 years. And here's me and my best gal we met just after high school. I'm going to be... Here's me and Pam Anderson. <laughs> All right? You want to know what Enough I said. Do, and I didn't even graduate from this asshole. <laughs> See, kids don't have to graduate. See, kids don't go to school. They have pictures with Pam. See, OB, that's what I'm talking about. The big guy like Anthony. He's got pictures of himself with Pamela Anderson. Or Rock, or whatever the hell she's calling herself. She worked at one of Daddy's clubs. <laughs> Thank she you, had Chris Penn. did things to her. That's the best Chris Penn. When you did that, and I saw it on the, the last we show, were we, did, we were in the office watching it. We were spitting up bulls off. Because you had the big beard. <laughs> you had the big gut and the hair like you said. It was great. It got, you got some good. show there, Jay. Very yeah, good. Yeah, you oh, you got to go. Wait, I, I got to go, too. Show. Where are you going? What? <laughs> I got to go. I got to do two you, want, you used don't you us to get here? a stupid picture. No, I didn't. Jim, Jim's got to go buy 30 tickets. I, I got to be there by 6 o'clock. I should have been out of here. Oh, 
All right, get I have to do a sound check. All right, check. Well, you're relieved. A sound check. I have to. They, I don't what, want your one. banjo, you drunken hillbilly? <laughs> faggot. Faggot. Yeah, you stupid faggot. <laughs> no one at, no Run. One, know what the reality of the show is? Key. Shut up, Frenchie. <laughs> yeah. The reality of the show is Kid yeah. Rock just jammed the, and was hanging with us, yeah. drinking and smoking and stuff. He's got the hot chick Pam there. Yep. And then we got Jay Moore and Jim Norton. All these people are leaving. We're going to be left with stupid Frenchie. With Frenchie. Yeah, so suck it, you bitch. <laughs> Right back no, down. Nothing's more degrading than being fixed up by a Frenchman. Okay, uh, Jim Norton, careful, careful on your way over there, love. I got news for you. All right, doll. The only way to follow Kid Rock, I believe, is with what I just heard. Hey, OP, I make you my men, bitch. <laughs> oh, and we're playing the feud. And come on, you pussy. And we're playing the feud. Wow. I will whip you like egg whites. It's oh, oh, my God. You missed, you pussy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Jim. Oh, oh, my God. God no. What was that? Holy Jesus. What did you throw at him? A bomb. Oh, my God. That exploded. No, look out. No, way. Watch me. Frenchy, look out. Stay, Stay with me, Frenchy. Oh, my God. He's got... No, not me. <laughs> Get out of my way. Oh, <laughs> Frenchy spraying beer at him. Holy Jesus! Oh no, Rick's coming over and grabbing Frenchie. Oh, oh, Put the top up, Norton. They're shooting at us. Oh no! Oh no! Opie's coming over. He's throwing a chair at Frenchie. Frenchie, Frenchie just shoved Opie. Opie just hit Frenchie in the face. Oh my God! Oh my God! Frenchie, fight club. How did Frenchie get that white flag on a stick so fast to wave? Club, fight club. All Frenchmen carry around a white flag on a stick. Frenchie's had a couple cocktails with Kid Rock. Get the Kid Rock guitar out of here. Oh, Norton, shut up. <laughs> Go to your gig. All right, everyone, settle down. Settle down now. Frenchie, beer all over the board. Why don't you settle down and find a nice girl? All right, let's bring let's bring it on back. God damn, that was funny. Take it off, man. Yo. Jay Moore, no, Opie never fights unless you're in this goddamn That's studio. Right. You're, the, you're, you're the like catalyst. a catalyst. You know, right you're a violence catalyst. I'm not underwater, you pussy. Hey, man, man. <laughs> oh, my God, here it goes. Oh, my God. No, no. Oh, my God, they're duking it out. Oh, my God, they're falling oh apart. Oh, 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 Frenchie had a takedown. Frenchie had a takedown. What's going on reverse? Oh, my God. Opie's on his back. Oh, they're walking around. Opie's being humiliated. What's happening here? Opie's back on top. Opie's back on top. Opie's whooping Frenchie's ass. Oh, oh Frenchie, man. They, into... they both got each other in headlocks. They flew into the car oh, rack. Oh, oh, this is going to get oh, They just hit the console. Opie, Opie, Opie just... now has Frenchie, Opie has Frenchie in some in type lock. of... I'm going to F you, And, uh, and he's hold. holding Frenchie. He's Frenchie got Frenchie just threw Opie off. Oh, Frenchie oh, just threw Opie off. And he went for oh. a chokehold. Wow. International Fight Club. Wow. <laughs> Frenchie went for a chokehold. You can't do that, Frenchie. He's choking him right now. Hey, don't get him choked out. Choke. All right, okay, all right, enough, enough. Oh, my God. Frenchie, are you okay? Frenchie is bleeding from the elbows. He is on the... Are you okay? <laughs> are you okay, Frenchie? But of course. <laughs> Dude, you whine like a little girl. That's the only reason you got me in a headlock. Wow. I'll let you go because you can't fight. Dude, I almost snapped your neck. You were crying like back. a little girl. He's got it on tape. Wow. 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 I got that back at you. That was a good fight. Kid Rock, and then we're brawling. Oh, and we're brawling. brawling. And then we're playing the feud. What, there's booze on the walls? What the hell is going on I in this place? I think I smell a cold open for more sports. Wow. <laughs> OB and Frenchie fighting. Wow. Frenchie's bleeding, too, by the elbows. Let me see, Frenchie. Anthony will play uh, Mel Kuyper. Wow. Frenchie is bleeding. Wow, and Opie on uh, at sea level. You did this all at sea level. Usually his fights take place deep below the surface of the water. Not a mark. No. That was strong. Nice, nice move of pushing his head into the amp. That rock. Yeah, yeah, that was good. Yeah. That's the amp that Kid Rock had just been playing out of. Dude, admit it, you were crying like a girl when I did that. Yeah, I, I did hear you know that. And then you know how you had you fears on a stupid amp like this? So then I let you go. <laughs> like a see? pussy, you put me in a headlock. I, I, did, hear, I, I got did hear you, girls at go I let you up because you were crying like a girl. At one point, I did hear Frenchie scream like, ah! <laughs> Opie made Frenchie's head into uh, Pete Townsend's guitar the head Frenchie into an amplifier. Threw a crucifix down. <laughs> Just the fact that Opie got out of those moves was was yeah. uh, pretty amazing. Frenchie, those were uh, actual like wrestling moves. I saw. I saw a crucifix. Frenchie at one point pushed Opie off, but it didn't really do you very good. Frenchie, you, you put up a good fight though for a Frenchman. No, 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 no. With the chokehold, I let go for a Frenchman. 
His, his, his face was in, in the amp. Hope he's good for mankind. Can't blow out the amp. You got a show to do. Opie doing his great reenactment of the uh, Third Reich, just marching <laughs> over the French. We got no. This time the up. French fought. Yeah, I know. Who saw that coming? I thought he'd surrender, have the bottle of wine, and be crying <laughs> underneath the arch. <laughs> it's like the Italian walking backwards to the German. Get hey, up. no, the new Italian joke is fly your plane What's into up, a, a building. Fly your be seventy-five years old, named Luigi, and fly your plane into a building in Milan. <laughs> Jackasses. Get a mic, because we got to give away some uh, Kid Rock stuff. Yeah. No, I'm rolling out. Where are you going? I'm doing... I'm Everyone's bailing out on us. The they were here to see Kid Rock and Pam. Was that it? No, I didn't... I was <laughs> surprised for it. You guys wouldn't tell me until I got here. Dude, right you didn't know. I we're came up either way. way. Just It could have been anybody. <clears throat> I was coming. I'm coming up. I'm coming. <laughs> There's nothing you can do about it. Go ahead, you know, Ben. Uh, if you were in Philly, New York, or Cleveland, we got some Kid Rock tickets. Cleveland shows May 17th. Those shows May 9th and New York May 10th. And they're really, really good seats. Look at Frenchie's knee. Frenchie, let me see your His name, knee man. knee is torn up. It's like Herman Moore. It's like someone turned around and said, hey, get a lot of fat soda. <laughs> <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> what did you say? You could use that 20 bucks you <laughs> <laughs> How you do? Oh. Wow. Frenchie. Frenchie looks like he's been breakdancing with windows on his shoulders. He <laughs> got effed up, bro. Frenchie, why do you bleed so much? I don't know. I got blue blood. Wow. Dude, not a scratch on me, man. I am like the Parisian bleeder. <laughs> that was like watching Pepe Le Pew and a chick. The way they were wiggling around. Kiss me. <laughs> I will go to my chokehold. You love it. <laughs> Hope he went under a fence that was just painted, got the white stripe on his back. <laughs> Frenchie thought he was a beach. skunk. <laughs> that was the first thing I ever heard the guy say. Suck it, you bitch. Ooh. <laughs> Cartoon rape. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it amounted to. All right, and oh. Kid Rock's latest CD, Cocky, man. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, give me a copy. I gotta listen to that on the way down. Hell yeah! What a great time we had with uh, Kid Rock. We got the clean version. You want the you want the one with all the dirty words and stuff. Yeah, I'll buy it. I'll I'll put some <laughs> I'll put some more money in this kitty.